Hello, my name is Mac Gillum. I'm a teacher at Mabinda Peter 12 State School. I've been here for eight and a half years and I teach Grade 10 Maths, Grade 10 Science, Maths B and Chemistry. In senior secondary in grades 11 and 12, I did Maths B and Maths C. All the Maths B concepts made sense to me. Maths C, I found it maybe a little bit more difficult to understand how to apply. Well, I got an OP1. Teaching probably wasn't at the top of my thought process at the end of school, but then when I was going through university, I realised maths is the, the part of university that I actually enjoy, and I enjoyed tutoring and helping my other classmates as well. I seem to have a knack of explaining it to the students a lot. That pushed me down that direction of that uh, maths teaching is actually quite enjoyable. Oh, I, I just enjoyed seeing kids understand maths and apply to whatever question or whatever scenario that they were working on at the time. Well, maths is about representing everyday things and work out situations or problems using you know, mass formulas, rearranging to actually establish set parameters. Like say for a business, how many things do I need to sell to make the maximum profit? That way someone's not just creating a business for the sake of creating a business, but they then actually analyze it to go, right, I need to make this much to break even, I need to make this much to get a maximum profit. It's very important that students learn the like, integer skills, rearranging skills, formula skills of junior because when they get into senior and a lot of concepts uh, utilise a lot of those skills and the students don't have those skills then they tend to struggle. They're limiting any options they may have at university because of prerequisite subjects. In grade 8 and 9 if they learnt those skills properly then they would be able to give themselves more options. If a student wanted to be a secondary maths teacher and they're in grades say 8, 9 or 10 then I would strongly encourage them to make sure that they've got the basic skills down pat, like rearranging, representing things algebraically. They're able to remember formulas, that's a big one. Yeah, any student who's good at maths in year 11 or 12, should, they should really consider becoming a maths teacher because chances are if you find that you're really good at maths and you understand the maths, then you'll probably take a lot of joy out of teaching other students. The good aspects of being a senior maths math mathematics teacher is that you tend to have those students who enjoy doing the maths and are particularly good at it, and you can actually then extend those students to show them applications of the maths that, say if you're just teaching a general group of kids, you wouldn't have the opportunity to actually go that far with them. And the other aspects of teaching that I enjoy, we've got playground duty and play sport with them, get that really good rapport with students happening. Well, the thing I like about maths is that it always makes sense, that you get an answer or answers that make sense and that it actually represents a, a real life situation and that you've just solved something using mass.